attempting to free star his Vincent routine in 1993. So I'm going to be pressing screen record in 3, 2, 1. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to sing you a beautiful song now. And this song is one of the most beautiful songs I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> Okay. This. <laughs> you made so well. In my life. Mm hmm. And, um. I'm sure. Excuse me a minute. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. I would like to sing you now one of the most beautiful songs I've ever heard in my whole life. Mm -hmm. And this song is called Vincent. <laughs> and for the heart of hearing... Vincent! <laughs> I wish I would have got a warning for that. That was loud. I love this man. This song... <laughs> it's about Vincent Van Gogh. He used mm -hmm. to have a little van with Gogh on the side of it. <laughs> <laughs> and people would walk up to him and say, Go on, Van Gogh. Seems like a dead joke. Love it. He would go back. To his little house where he lived, and there he would do beautiful paintings in beautiful colors. Oh, they were beautiful. But alas, he could not sell any of his paintings. And this made him very sad and depressed. To the only woman <laughs> in his life he could ever trust. <laughs> yes, he went back to the only woman he could ever trust in his life, his mother. And that night, he spoke to his mother softly about his paintings he couldn't sell. He said, Mother. Oh, Mother. For why can I sell none of my paintings? She said the crap. This remark, he went into a rage <laughs> and cut off his left ear. Oh, uh, that was your right ear. He cut off his left <laughs> ear. <laughs> oh my goodness. His ear fell to the floor. a big ear. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to sing you now that beautiful song. You've read the record. You've heard the book. You said that backwards, but that was funny. I would like to sing you that song, ladies and gentlemen, because I'd like to sing it live for you, because most people in our profession, and this is the truth, I'm not joking now, as you can see by my face. This is, this is serious. You watch Top of the Pops and everybody minds. Everybody. Even the big stars, like Michael Jackson. He minds. 
He's there miming Michael. Oh, yes. He has a man that stood behind there with a tape machine. He fixed a tape machine on, and the, the tapes go round, and his voice comes through the speakers, and it's not him singing. No, he's just giving that. Uh oh, it's loading crap. There we go. <laughs> that nose joke, though. I want to go back a little, but I'm not going to, but that's hilarious. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, that's why I've brought my band with me tonight to sing for you live. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, film song, Vincent. song now with my guitarist Roger McHugh. Roger McHugh. Oh, I get it. Yeah. <laughs> Is he trying to act like he's signaling someone to turn a table? That's funny. Your palette blue gray. Look out on a summer's day. He has a good voice. All <laughs> the darkness in my soul. Hmm. <laughs> Sketch the trees and 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 sketch the tr
<laughs> did he just mouth you bastard? I think he did. And then it looked like he said, fucking white tallest is done. I don't know if he did or not, but that's what it looked like. This world was never meant for one as beautiful. awesome and hilarious i'd heard of him doing the sped up slow down type of singing before but i've never seen him do it with this routine before i've heard of the vincent routine but i'd never seen it and this was requested by a friend of mine on facebook and that was hilarious you know you've watched something and you don't really quite know what to say <laughs> all i gotta say is he is truly missed and I'm so glad to be a fan, you know what I mean? And um, the funny or weird thing is, is that I actually became a fan of Freddie Starr. Like the year he passed away, I discovered him on YouTube. And ever since then, I've loved him to death. And um, he was amazing. He was really, truly a talent. And I used to think he was one of the most, well, when he was younger, one of the most handsome comedians I've ever seen. And I loved his smile and personality and his accent and his, just his type of humor I love, you know. It may not be for everybody, but I love it. And, um, yeah, he's, he's truly missed and loved. Uh, that was awesome. Thank you for requesting that. Please like, comment, subscribe, click the notification button to get notified for new and upcoming reaction videos. My Facebook is at Have a Very Nice Day, and as always, thank you all for watching.